hello everyone welcome back to my channel so my dear friends uh, today i am with the another passing strategy video passing package for the advanced calculus and numerical methods which is m2 for the 2021 scheme students this is uh, subject code is uh, 21 mat 21 as i have completed all passing package for the other mathematics subjects like uh, m m3 m1 and m4 i will just put the links in the description box you can easily avail them so uh, without any wasting a time let me start with the passing module which is the fifth module it is considered as passing module in this particular subject that is mathematics second in the actually uh, second math was uh, considered as toughest subject as far as engineering is concerned but uh, for the 2021 and 2022 scheme students this time uh, maths is uh, second maths is very easy as far as uh, 18 scheme maths is concerned right so module 5 is uh, passing my dear friends just 20 marks are just in your pocket so you have to focus on four concepts one is a taylor series method which is the problematic numerical method over there i have make uh, i have already uh, what we call as done with the video over there for this taylor series method you can just uh, refer the link also which i will provide in the description box and modified euler's method and range cutta method of fourth order Milne's predictor and character formula. So these are the four topics uh, which you have to cover in this particular module. I have made uh, separate videos for this. Uh, for these topics, you can just refer them also so that you will cover 20 marks with ease over there. So this is the passing module you should remember. You don't have to leave uh, any concept from this module over there. Then module four, which is also a passing module. Uh, so 20 marks are all already in your pocket now. And another 20 marks are from module fourth. So regular falsi method you have to focus on and newton Rapson method you have to do problems on these particular methods no need to go for the derivation part and newton's forward and backward formulas newton's divided difference formula and lagrange's interpolation formula and simpson's one third and three by eighth rule so these are the six topics which you have to cover in the module four so that you will easily get uh, 20 marks also from this particular module over here so these two are the passing modules most important uh, i may call it the super important super important modules that is module 5 and module 4 so focus on these two modules very well my dear friends practice a lot for this then module 2 is also a passing module in which you have to cover find the directional derivative of suppose phi is equal to x square yz plus 4 xz square at the points 1 comma minus 2 1 in the direction of the vector 2i cap minus j cap minus 2k cap so it is a very simple problem over there find the di uh, directional derivative if you want separate word, uh, video for it i will uh, i may also make uh, the problem solving video for this particular directional derivative so next part is uh, find divergence of f and curl of f vector where f vector is equal to gradient of x cube plus y cube plus z cube minus 3xyz and you have to focus on solenoidal and irrotational vector fields uh, which are the problems on that basis so you have to cover these three topics from this module second otherwise in the or part vector integration part is over there so you have to just ponder on the first part that is uh, directional derivative differentiate uh, that is differential integration over there right sorry vector differentiation over there so this is the uh, module second it is also a passing module so these three are the super important modules which you have to ponder on rest of the modules uh, it is according to your own choice according to your own convenience if you are convenient if you have some potentiality to cover all the modules to pass this particular subject then go for the module third which is the partial differential equations uh, in which definite question is there uh, like with usual notations derive a one dimensional heat equation it is the most important question you have to deal with it only a derivation part is there just memorize it remember it and uh, with the usual notations derive a one dimensional wave equation these two are the super important questions from this module uh, module three over here if you just cover uh, those uh, passing modules which i mentioned earlier that passing modules then refer if you only refer one question from this particular module it is enough uh, to cover uh, to pass this uh, particular subject over there right then form the pot, uh, partial differential equation by eliminating arbitrary function from the relation uh, equation will be given ax plus by plus cz is equal to f of x square plus y square plus z square so focus on these problems if you have some potentiality if you can cover all the syllabus so you have to focus on this partial differential equation form uh, formation uh, equations will be given and also arbitrary constants questions will be like form the partial differential equation by eliminating arbitrary constants over there right so these are the two concepts one is the arbitrary function one is the arbitrary constants 
then solution of Langrage is linear partial differential equation it is according to the syllabus you can also refer this particular variety over there so right then module first comes up in which uh, you have to do only one problem just because there is a lot of integration in multiple integral parties were there double integration triple in, triple integration if you are weak in the integration part integral calculus part over there then you have to focus on one derivation from this uh, module first which is the super important uh what you call is question over there so this is derive the relation between gamma and beta functions and uh, so uh, you have to cover this uh, gamma beta beta and gamma function if you are convenient uh, if you have some uh, ideas about double integration and triple integration so go through evaluation of double and triple integration if convenient if so if not possible then leave uh, this particular integral part multiple integral part uh, just uh, focus on one question that is derive the relation between gamma and beta functions it will be the definite question over there in the examination so i hope my dear friends this much content is enough uh, for passing uh, the m2 subject which is simpler one as far as the 18 scheme maths is concerned m2 is concerned so this time it is very easy to cover so my dear friends you have to practice a lot for this subject so that it becomes uh, easy for you people to conquer this subject without any hesitation over there so thanks for watching my video